right here, I have two pairs of Panda Dunks. We have the Gen version right here, which was from Nike.com, and we have another version right here, which is from Panda Buy. So we're going to go ahead and compare the two. So looking at the Gen, see the leather, notice the white stitching right there. And looking at the leather grain, it's just really nice. And then even the lace, it's a little bit of a tighter um, knit lace compared to just regular shoelaces that you get. So you can see just the kind of the pebbling on the uh, leather. This is the rep version. And you can actually see the same quality of pebbling on the white and the black parts. And the lace is also this tightly woven, high quality lace. Looking at the tag, you have your Nike. And looking at the tag, you also have your Nike. So uh, side by side, it is, um, I mean, it's exact. Like you cannot tell the difference between them. Going to the toe box also, uh, it looks a little bit different because this is a bigger size, but just looking at the shape of the toe box, looks exact. The holes in the front panel also exact. Looking at the back of the shoes, again, you have the Nike. Here you have the Nike. And you could say it might be just a little bit off right there, but I've seen that in uh, regular Nikes as well. You have the three uh, white st stitching across here. You also have the three white stitching. The sole. Up on the front, you have the stars. And right here, you also have the stars. So comparing these dunks, I would say um, there is no difference between these two shoes. In fact, I would say that depending on where you order them, they're getting made in the exact same factories as the gens because it is exact. Uh, on feet, they feel exactly the same in terms of uh, just cushioning and quality. So, uh, there you go. Gen Panda versus the Panda by Rep Panda.